Hi, I'm Carmelo Sagona and welcome to my kitchen. Today I wanted to tell you all about the two Carmelos wine. Uh, I wanted to give you a little story about the wine before we get going on the taste of this wine. Um, this is named after my grandfather, Carmelo Sagona, and myself, Carmelo Sagona. Here's an image of him, a photo of him and my grandmother when they got married. He came over from Sicily in 1912, but this is a picture of them when they got married in 1917. He sent for her, she came over, they got married, lived happily ever after. Um, but he brought with him the tradition of making wine, and Zinfandel wine was the wine that he made. Our Sunday meals were always filled with pasta and beautiful fagachas and all these different foods, but we always had wine at the table. Um, he made this Zinfandel wine, and, and uh, the way he did this was he uh, had grapes brought to uh, the bottom of the street where he lived. He lived up by Twin Peaks in San Francisco. He had a double lot up there, a huge lot. He made this in the basement. So the trucks couldn't make it up the hill. They had to leave the grapes down below. Six tons of Zinfandel, one ton of Muscat, and they hand carried them in these farm lots all the way up the hill. And then they pressed them and made their wine. It was very, very good. I always wanted to duplicate that. Every time I went down to the basement, I always had that musty smell of the barrel and the grapes and the wine. I always wanted, we finally made this come true. Here we are, we have the two Carmelo Zinfandel. This is what he used to make. We went through a lot of takes on this. We finally found some old vine Zins. We're working with a venture who does a great job for us. This is really a good tasting. It's an everyday price and uh, you know, if you just let this open up a little bit, um, you'll get some nice berry notes. It's, it's, not, it's a little bit fruity taste. It's very well balanced. It's not tannic. So uh, uh, it hits a real sweet spot, not real jammy. We also have the Syrah. Uh, let this open up a little bit longer. Um, this is a special occasion wine, but you know, it could be an everyday drinker as well. Um, this is real good taste. And it also has some berry notes and it's real soft and smooth. So both of these will go with um, a marinara sauce or a pizza or a, a different kind of meats. Um, barbecue, this uh, Syrah will go with the barbecue. So they go very well together. I'd like to invite you to come down our store to try these wines. And if you do come down, please take a look at the murals on the walls. They're all of our family photos that kind of tell the story of who we are and how we came about with our small business. So hope to see you real soon at Sagonis.